a lot of young children with the chronic diseases, with obesity. They themselves have to be very careful about this Christmas as well. So don't overdo the sweets. We like all the, the, the cakes and so on. Take small amounts. And for the children, don't give them a taste of alcohol. That's not good. Don't encourage them into that, just a little taste. Because you don't know what effect it could have on them and, and then they get into the habit. So alcohol, um, be careful with that. That could be a very serious thing as far as the children are concerned. We also need to look at um, alcohol in other persons. Use a smaller plate, don't use those large plates. Cut out the fried foods and fatty foods and greasy foods. Yes, take your ham and turkey and jerk, enjoy them, but you can't overdo this. Not in Christmas 2023. We, our hospitals are full. You complain about a &E, hospitals are full. We have a large number of people who are getting strokes and heart attacks, especially coming out of the COVID-19 pandemic. We're seeing a lot more people who have not looked after themselves as well and they're probably having the complications right now. Um, so portion size is very important. When we're cooking rice and peas, let's switch it around, let's do peas and rice. Which means that when you go to have your meal, when you take up a fork of that meal, you should be seeing more peas and less rice. Another thing you can always do is that rather than just serving the vegetables on the side, you can include a lot of vegetables, whether you're going to grate a carrot or whether you're going to grate some Christophine. You can add all of these to the different stews and sauces you're going to make. And these can actually help to, to, to thicken um, your sauces while adding flavor at the same time. If you're going to do a chicken stew, you're baking a chicken stew, you can also add in some kidney beans in, the, in that stew.